Hey uh, folks, it's a laughing order here. I'm coming to you from Hatfield Police Station. And um, I'm out and about in Hatfieldshire. And I'm going to see how we get on, ladies and gentlemen. And, um, and we'll take it from there. So if you enjoyed the video, guys, please like it. Feel free to share it. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button. And we'll certainly see if we can get a laugh out of this lot. And um, this is the morning that I had the, um, that telephone call. Uh, it's been put up. So I think it's... It's something that I'm going to try and do more of because I, I do get quite a fair share of cold callers so I may as well have a bit of fun with it and share that experience with you guys uh, so, um, I'm just going to have a wee look around the front and I'll pick it back up to you guys shortly It's not clocked up here, ladies and gentlemen. Look at the camera, it's spying on someone over there. What is he doing? Who's he spying on? Just to know who he's spying on. So I'm at the back end of Hatfield Station guys, uh, I don't know why I'm whispering still, but I'm at the back end of Hatfield Station uh, I just arrived, I was doing, <laughs> I was just having a wee scout around the building, I came for a wee walk before I started rolling Just deciding where was the best place to kick it off from, obviously I've done that intro um, I was deciding whether I should uh, go into the reception, there is two gates, an entrance and an exit um, So I was sort of deciding which, which side would probably be best and, um, I just pretty much then I finished up, came round here and I seen this guy poking his camera out the window. So he had and I was a bit curious to know. See some of the high vis through there. Very curious to know. What he was looking at, he had a bigger lens on it, he's taking that off but it keeps coming up and adjusting it and um, you know it just goes to show how sort of covert these devices are because if you think about it, you're walking past the street and there's sat at a window, you're never going to notice it if they're, if they're spying on someone uh, but to balance it out, I'm no doubt potentially spying on people that could be up to some serious levels of Criminality. You just know that little bit at the back is. So, just for your reference, guys, I have been here before. I don't think I put this one up. I may have done. Yeah, I can't remember. It was in track. Um, but I have been here before. And it was pretty much uneventful. There was no real issues from what I can recall. Um, yeah. But, needless to say, I was in the area. 
and um, I said to come have a poke around and have a look around and see if anything's changed. I'm really curious to know what that big round thing is in the back there. Well, let's see if we can get a look through this fence. So, ladies and gentlemen, I've just finished Hatfield Police Station, yeah, and um, someone must have seen me doing it, this guy, and he just says to me, well, I'll put a camera away, stop filming, well, you better not go in there and do that, and point it towards this facility, Affinity Water, and um, I thought, what a strange thing to say, you know, so, um, he just sort of said it and walked off, and uh, I thought, you know, I'm not going to get drawn into an argument with him. Certainly, by the time I set the camera and that up, um, it probably would have, uh, and I changed his tune or disappeared anyway. So I thought, you know what? Um, it's like those people that, that say, uh, don't, I don't want to be filmed. Well, I'm certainly going to start filming you because you've, um, you've brought the attention on yourself. So, and I've lost through. That's exactly what I'm going to do. I'm going to have a look around here. And, uh, I'm going to pay you guys a bit of attention, but it's a nice building, but it's a nice location. It's just on the corner from uh, Hatfield Police Station. So, pedestrian exit to Tamberlin Way. But it looks fairly new, I don't think it's that old. But we'll certainly see how we got on. So, as I say, if you enjoyed this video, guys, please like it. Feel free to share it. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button. And we'll see if we get any laughs out of this lot today. Save our streams. Yeah, they should save our streams. Got horse pipe pans up and down the country and whatever else. Very impressive looking building, though. That's what it is. Very impressive looking building. Exit that way. Affinity water. Hiya. Pardon? Can I help? Yeah, I'm just interested in your pretty impressive looking building. Okay, you can't really film on site, it's private property. Yeah. You can film from out there. Oh, I'm still going to film. But not in here. Yeah. You can't. Oh, I am at the moment, unfortunately. Well, I'm asking you if you can do it from the, uh, above on the footpath. No, I'll do it when I'm done. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I'll do it when I I'm done. I need you to lift off the property. Pardon? Yeah, I'll leave my own time. I'm not here to cause any problems. I just here to sort of film the nice building. It's nice architecture, and um, and yeah, that's pretty much it. I'm just yeah, but I need you uh, to do it off off our land. Right, I'll do it. I'll, it's I'll, private property. Is it right? Okay, yeah. right, that's not a problem. So if you can go up on the footpath, please. No, I'm not going to do that, unfortunately. Right. Just because I'll go when I'm ready. Invited? Pardon? It's open access, it's open, there's an implied right of access, um, it's open to the yeah, public, you've got a reception. Can come in, yeah. I am reception. Uh, yeah, that's fine, you've got visitor access, so I'm here to visit your building. Yeah, um, no, so, you haven't been invited. It doesn't need to be invited, it's visitor, visitor yeah, access. Yeah, come into the building. I'm not going into the building, I'm just getting outside of it, just being nosy, you know. But, okay, this is our CEO coming. Is it? Awesome. So... Uh, I need you to leave. Yeah, I'll go when I'm ready. I'm just, no, I'm just going to film the rest of, the rest of the area, and then that'll be that. What are you doing? What are you doing? Oh, I'm just filming your, your impressive looking building. Can you just switch that off, please? No, I can't. Why not? Because it's what I do. I go about filming places. It's private property. I understand that. Yeah, yeah. that's not so a problem. You can do it from above, but yeah. not on the side. No, I, I get what you're saying, but I'm just having a look around. So I'm just going to suck at the building. Ask you to leave the property, please. Okay. Right. Yeah, no, but like, 
if you hadn't stopped me, I'd have been halfway back round and I'd have been on my way out, yeah, you know. I like, pointed you out, so you to be on side. Yeah, it's not an issue. I don't see what the problem is. Like, if you just let me go on with it, you could show your company in good light and uh, I could film your impressive looking building because it, it does look very nice. Yeah. And that'll be that. Anyway, where was I? I think I'm funny she went, oh, a CEO's coming, the CEO, oh no, help, come quick, it's the CEO, the CEO. Oh, I don't see why that we've got an issue, this is like, this all started because someone walking past me in the street, you know, I was on my way back to my car, I'd finished, I dropped filming at the police station, and uh, I'd, this is right next to the police station, and I don't know if he works here or what, but... He, he sort of passed me by, man, you better not film in there, and pointed over this way. So, that means I'm going to film over here. So I am. This lady's walking past in a little car. Is she? It's a very impressive looking building. It's nice. I quite like it. But we're going to go and have a look round up here. We can on the high ground. We get a, a view. But they don't. When they say jump, I don't reply. How high? I don't follow their directives. Um, staff and visitors only. I was visiting. Sure, I was. Hey, folks, it's a laughing order here. And I'm in Hatfield, so I've just come from Hatfield Police Station. Um, it's pretty much non-event, but I'm going to pop into the Job Centre Plus and so I see what local opportunities are available in the area and, um, and we'll take it from there. So what, it'll be the usual drill guys, I'll drop the video while I get in now um, and I'll pick it back up at the earliest opportunity. Uh, so, I don't know. Pardon? Well, I'm just here to see what local opportunities are in the area, my friend, and, um, and yeah, that's pretty much it. Oh, okay. Are you recording me today? I am. Oh, okay. Yeah. Um, I'm going to ask you if you can record me, is that right? Oh, I'm going to record you, my friend. Yeah, yeah, sorry. That's what I do, unfortunately. Oh, no, no, All right, mate. I appreciate you being polite, though. It goes a long way. Um, so, half your job centre. So, we don't have much in terms of opportunities. My service box. And in the last 12 months, Hatfield Job Centre supported 1,368 people into work. That's incredible. If it's true. So, we've got urgent jobs in part time cleaners in Wellwyn Garden City, full time warehouse, Wellwyn Garden City, full time van drivers, Wellwyn Garden City. I don't even know if I'm pronouncing that properly. Support workers in Wellwyn Garden City, support workers in Potter's Bar, support workers and waking night staff, Wellwyn Garden City, senior support workers, Wellwyn Garden City, senior support workers, Potter's Bar, Elias, practitioners. Mm -hmm. So we don't have a lot in terms of information at, um, at any roles. I've seen these dotted about. I'm not just saving advice. And the country's in a sorry state, nobody can afford to pay their bills. Oh, they got a defibrillator in here. I can't see that word properly. So I said, not much to see in here, guys. I need to be mindful that there is members of the public using the services. Oh, got some more here. I'm pretty sure that's a chief inspector. Sure it is in that picture. 
He was your guy that was on the photo at the police station. One council, two towns, endless opportunities. Ever been, thought I've been a metro line bus driver. I'm having a lot of meeting over there. I think you need to do that now. Just bring those results with you to your next appointment, and that helps inform us as well. Got some B&M. Work experience. Money management training sessions. Crazy, that. Something like that. I mean, it could be sooner, but it's probably going to be a couple of weeks. Yeah, it's another day. I'm moving away. Very wise. Well done, mate. You've done well. Thank you. I appreciate it, yeah? Take care. So, Hartfield Job Centre, ladies and gentlemen, what do you think? They've done it okay. Half of the big man asked me not to record, but he was very polite. He was okay. Just let me get on with it. But, um, but yeah, not much to see in there. I like in terms of opportunities. If I was um, job seeking in there, I'd be a little bit concerned because uh, there's not much available. So, not a good situation. But yeah, as I say, I'll leave it at that. Um, let me know what you think in the comments. It's been it's been a good one, few and far between. Um, and yeah, we'll leave it at that, ladies and gentlemen. So, if you have enjoyed this video, please like it, feel free to share it, and don't forget, pop down, hit that subscribe button. I really appreciate it. Until next time, stay safe. Bye-bye.